Hi, this is Walford Kaufman bringing you another devotion. Did you ever have the pleasure, the joy to go to the circus? Oh, what an adventure. It could have been the big one, the Ringling Brothers, or it could have been one of those smaller circuses that used to go through the small towns. But to go there, and especially if they had that trapeze artist, that trapeze artist, those that would climb way up into the air and they would grab a hold of this bar and they swing back and forth. And oh man, no, I never would climb that high. And then they would turn around and they would get themselves and they would be holding on to that bar with the back of their knees. That's all. And we were holding our breath. They're so far up. But then they swing back and forth and then they let go of that bar. That's right. They let go of the bar, that bar that at least bringing them some uh, safety. But then they're flying through the air, holding on to nothing. And we'd hold our breath, waiting for them to grab that other bar on the other side. And we all break out just clapping. Oh, uh, how wonderful this was. But what did it feel like for those few short, maybe not even two or three seconds that they were in the air? holding on to nothing. One writer has said, that's faith. That's faith. See, we know what God has done in our life in the past. We know what He's done. But then we also know what He's going to do as we trust in the Word of God. We know that He is going to take care of us. But what about when we have to let go of one as we're waiting for the other? That's what we're doing now. That's where we're living now. It's called faith is faith. But let us claim these words. This comes from Psalm 66, starting in verse 1. Shout with joy to God, all the earth. Sing the glory of His name. Make the, His praise glorious. Say to God, how awesome are your deeds. So great is your power that your enemies cringe before you. All the earth bows down to you. They sing praise to you. They sing praise to your name. Come and see what God has done, how awesome His works in man's behalf. So we see how awesome God has been. And you know what? God is awesome right now. In the in-between place, as we're hanging through life, we can see how God is still working. And you know what? He's going to work tomorrow in our life. He's going to work eternity in our life as we trust in Him. So today, you might feel like you're in the midst, in between. But guess what? You might be in between, but God is still with you. Isn't that something to praise the Lord for? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank You that this life that we're living, we're not by ourselves. Even though we kind of let go of one thing to, and waiting on the other, You're still right here with us. And we praise You. Guide us through this day, this evening, whenever we're watching this, listen to this, and let us give You praise for what You've done, what You're doing, and what You're going to do in our lives as we trust in You. In Jesus' name, Amen. So today, think about it. Are there some things you need to let go of? If you're going to get to the place you need to be, let go and let God take control.